I'm Ollie Briggs, caddy for Julian Surrey. This week's Tour Caddies vlog will give you an insight into how we prepare for tournaments and what we do when the cameras aren't rolling. Thursday morning, day one Dubai, both myself and Tim have afternoon tea time, so we've had a full morning to prepare ourselves. But the PS4, bit of Warzone action last night, Tim got his arse handed to him as usual. The clubs are nice and clean, no mud in those grooves, they're ready to go. We have some golf balls ready to be marked up, ready for today's play, and we can also check the weather. So at 12 o'clock when we're teeing off, wind's nice and low, perfect and it's going to stay that way for the whole day. A bit of a switch there to the north. Move outside, we have Tim putting the pins in. Hello, Tim. Email from the tour with today's positions and you just put them in the book. There it is. Caddy tip of the day though is this. Hand wash detergent. You can wash your sweaty socks without having to pay extortionate hotel prices. And Tim being from Edinburgh, it's always going to work well. And there is the view across towards the palm. Unfortunately, due to government restrictions, we have to stay in our hotel, we're not allowed out, but it's a nice view anyway. It's 11.25, we're due to tee off in 35 minutes, and I'm back in the hotel room. Uh, someone was doing practice swings in their room and left their eight iron in the room whilst we're warming up for the first round. Let's hope it doesn't affect anything. Just got back to the hotel room. Julian managed to shoot level par this afternoon. As expected, the wind did switch to the north and it picked up quite a bit as well, which made the, uh, the holes coming in play a little bit more difficult. He played quite well, didn't quite hold as many putts as he usually would do, uh, but the good news was the eight iron drama from before the round didn't really affect him as we birded the first hole and then had to use it on our second hole, which was the first par three of our day. It just goes to show, if you give yourself enough time before you do get to the course, if anything like this does happen, I fortunately had the time to go back to the hotel, get it whilst Julian was just going through his warm-up routine, so there was no dramas there. 